the world that we live in is beautiful. It's been given us by Jesus Christ to do beautiful things in it. He said, be fruitful and multiply to Adam and Eve. He continues to say the same thing today to modern day Adams and Eves. Be fruitful and multiply because it is a beautiful thing to multiply on the earth. However, when you are bringing offspring, progeny into the planet, into an ecosystem that is frankly unsurvivable even by you, when you are creating a horror, nightmarish movie for the future generation to live in, how under heaven can there be any incentive to be fruitful and to multiply? This planet has been made for human beings, for animals, for plant life, essentially whatever is on the earth right now. That's what it is that this planet has been made for. It was never fashioned, formed or manufactured, if you want to call it that, by God on high for demons, for entities, for fallen spirits. It was never intended for things living in the second heaven to pierce into our realm. Do you want to know why the earth is teeming at the falls with so much demonic activity? It is because human beings are experimental. We are in the 21st century by a landslide, by far, the most experimental generation to date. And it is therefore no wonder that we are highly likely the last generation to ever exist on the planet prior to the Great Tribulation. We just keep on dabbling. Do you understand what I'm saying? With all different kinds of entities. These entities, when they pop into our ecosystem, our stratosphere, then start to cause disaster because it's all they can do. It's written in God's word that the devil has come to steal, to kill and to destroy. While Jesus Christ has come to give us life and life abundantly. So let me make it abundantly clear that when you dabble with entities, you are magnifying the amount of darkness on the earth in comparison to light since you are rejecting the one that gives life and life abundantly and when you magnify that darkness you magnify death destruction and murder that which kills steals and destroys it is no wonder therefore that crime rates are rising across the world it is no wonder therefore that people are losing their minds essentially mental illness is now a global epidemic it is no wonder people can not sleep at night without being harassed lambasted like no man's business by nightmares it is no wonder the entertainment industry is teeming at the folds with silly producers and executives creating entertainment all for the purpose of converting the planet into a bunch of crazy fools doing strange things. We have all just allowed entities to live among us.